half kneeling resistance band row. When we get set up, I use a long glute resistance band anchored to the squat rack here. And we're trying to get it roughly at shoulder height when I'm in a kneeling position. Whatever arm is doing the work, that leg is gonna be down. So I'm gonna pull with my left hand, so my left knee is going down. When I get set up, I want my knee to be directly in line with my anchor point. A lot of people will lean back onto their back leg to create the pulling motion. We want you to stay as tall as you can from your knee that's on the ground to the top of your head, and then push your front leg into the ground so that keeps you in a good, stable position. From there, you're gonna fire your left glute and then slightly push your left toe into the ground. That's gonna lock up your hips. With all of our rowing variations, we wanna emphasize not keeping your elbow at your side. People will slam their elbow into their rib cage and that limits how much their shoulder blade can move on their rib cage. We want good scapulothoracic motion while we're doing this. So, simple way to do that, Make sure you can fit a fist between your elbow and your rib cage at all times. Starting position is that arm forward. My shoulder blade comes around. I'm initiating the movement by bringing my shoulder blade back, elbow slightly away from my side, and I'm stopping here. I'm not worried about getting way back into that back position. You wanna stop when your humerus or your upper arm bone gets about parallel with your spine. 